Jerry Kokesh, Biathlon World Editor, here in snowy Rupolding, where we expect it to be cold and snowy all week long as World Cup 5 starts tomorrow with the men's 20K. It's going to be followed by the women's 15K, relays, and mass starts. The individuals are really a shooting competition with a bit of skiing thrown in between. With new snow and probably slow conditions, shooting will be more critical than ever over the next two days. It's all about the shooting, of course, everyone knows this. Uh, I feel strong in the uh, tracks, so yeah, I think it's up to the shooting range to decide who will win this. What about these tracks if we get a lot of snow, though? Yeah, it can be heavy, and, and especially I'm not hoping the, the bib will uh, choose the podium. Have you ever sat clean in an individual? Uh, no. In fact, no. Okay, then tomorrow's the day. Tomorrow is the day. In an individual, are you thinking differently than you were thinking in the sprints? For sure. It'll be uh, more emphasis on shooting, of course. And with such a calm range here, it's extra important to shoot 90, 95, 100%. And then if the conditions are going to be tough, just to make sure that you're just mentally ready and prepared for it. It is an easy range. Everybody knows it. It goes down, it's a downhill inside, no wind. So tomorrow you have to shoot clean if you want to win. This week, the German men want to step up to the podium in the second home World Cup to keep pace with their women's team. This group of women will be putting the pressure on Gabriela Sukalaba along with Marie Durand Herbert, who is in second place in the World Cup total score, with Tarje Bo and Simon Eder both topping Martin Foucault last week. The big question is who will challenge the Olympic and world champion in the individual tomorrow? Most importantly, here in Rupolding, it now looks like real winner as World Cup 5 starts. <laughs>